Don't let the look on his face fool you. Steve Auger from North Bill Ricca loves working out. It's better than any pill. It's better than than anything. It just you know gets the endorphins stirring and uh, just you know keeps me right up here. These days, Auger works out mainly by himself. But 16 years ago, when he started, he hired a personal trainer. They can help you with nutrition. They can motivate you. They can they can be your shrink on days when you don't feel like working out. I'm gonna have you come down just a little less far. With five years' experience as a personal trainer and manager, Mary Pellin helps clients come up with achievable goals and, more importantly, she says, a plan for how to achieve them. It's important that you don't say, "I'm gonna go to the gym seven days a week." If you're someone that's never gone to the gym before, you're gonna get burnt out. Other tips, rely on a routine to get you to the gym on certain days and at certain times, but then vary your activity once you get there. Track your progress and celebrate even small achievements. For me, my secret weapon for showing up to the gym day after day, week after week, is to write down every exercise, every set, every rep in this little black book. I promise no one's, no one's judging. Like, why judge somebody who's in the gym trying to better themselves? That's stupid. You know, that little black book of mine is not just filled with progress. There's also lots of setbacks in there, lots of times when I just had to scale back and start all over. Live in Chelmsford, David Bunnick, WCVB News Center 5.